Hi everybody, in today's video we're going to be drawing two new brands for our um, untried polish challenge. I did notice some of you guys are using the hashtag untried polish challenge 2019. I love it. I'm going to steal it. I'm going to start tagging my photos on Instagram with that tag as well and probably start putting them in my videos. So thank you guys for coming up with it. I hope nobody minds that I am going to steal it, but I am going to steal it. Um, so I really have enjoyed the last two weeks of OPI and KB Shimmer Untrieds, but I just feel like it went by really, really fast. Um, I have a ton of OPI Untrieds. I really think I could wear OPIs that I um, have not tried yet for two or three months probably, but I'm ready to move on to some new brands and kind of see. Um, and you guys, thank you so much for participating. You guys make it really fun and like motivational for me to change my nails out more often. And then like, I love seeing what you guys are doing. So please, please keep using the hashtags. Keep tagging me in your photos. Um, I just really love looking at what everybody's wearing and you guys are coming up with some really beautiful manicures. So um, I'm going to pick the indie first this time. And I'm gonna shake it up. Um, and the first indie brand or the next indie brand we're going to wear is going to be Native War Paints. So I personally do not own any from this indie brand, but when I was making up my indie brand list, I just really noticed that I didn't have that many indies. And I know a lot of you guys do have a ton of indies. So I picked some brands that I know are fairly popular amongst people and I threw them in. And then my idea was, well, like I'll just use more of my mainstreams while people focus on, you know, one or the other or both or whatever. So I will not be wearing any untried native war paints just because I don't have any from this brand at all. But um, hopefully the mainstream brand is good and I'll get a lot of untrieds worn from the mainstream brand. Um, So the mainstream brand we're gonna be wearing next is Revlon that's a good one I'm excited I was actually kind of thinking about Revlon so I'm glad that that one came up um, I just bought some Revlons on clearance from Walmart so you probably will be seeing some of those um, and then I know that Valentine's will be coming up during these next two weeks because let me check my calendar so the next two weeks of polishes are going to be going from February 3rd to February 17th. So Valentine's Day will kind of tie into there. So I know some of you may take a break because you have like ideas of what you want to do for Valentine's Day. I completely understand. Luckily for me, um, if you can see right here, I have a ton of like pinkishy Revlons and some of these are unworn. So um, I'm all set for Valentine's Day, I feel like. Um, so that's good. Um, and then the hashtags are going to be Native War Paints Untrieds, Revlon Untrieds, and then if you want to tag your video also with um, Untried Polish Challenge 2019, I have seen a few people using that hashtag as well. And, and just tag me on your Instagram post. Um, I love, love, love when you guys tag me. It's easier for me. I do follow the hashtags and every once in a while, you know, like, you know, maybe every other day I like search the hashtag and make sure I see everything and, you know, look at all of what you guys are doing. But if you tag me, I for sure see it. So um, I'm super excited for the next two weeks, you guys. Thank you again so much for your participation. It's been really fun. The more that people that participate, like the funner it is for me and like the more motivational it is for me as well. So that is it for this video. Um, I hope you guys like it. If you did, please make sure to click the like button down below. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do. And thanks you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video. 